Welcome back everybody. We are now looking at 22 Quick Street in Egg Harbor Township, New Jersey. This is a two bedroom, two bath manufactured home. It's a Schult. It's in Harbor Crossings manufactured home community. We are a land lease community, which means everybody owns their homes, but leases the land. We have a monthly lot fee, which you can see on the website that includes water and sewer, garbage and recycling pickup, and then leasing the land. So here you're seeing the house from the outside. This is a gray vinyl siding and little blue shutters. And this family added awnings over the front three windows and the little awning protection over the front door. I believe the two um, fiberglass steps are being replaced, the one in the front and the one in the back. This is a unique corner lot. There's a beautiful yard in the front and in the back. It's got natural gas, and this is central air conditioning. You'll see the unit in the back. There it is. And in the show notes, you can read all about the description about the house and the age of many of the appliances. Uh, a lot of them have been re... Uh, in You know, new ones have been installed. Here you've got skirting on the back of the house and in the front also. And there's the back door, and I believe the... A uh, homeowner is cleaning up. We do a resale lot inspection on every house before um, a person lists their home. But in this case, we listed the house before he completed some of the items. So he's just removing some of the debris that you see there. This house has a little shed and it'll be power washed. Those little pavers will be removed and then the grass will be repaired where there's a little divot there. In the front of the house, um, you've got little downspout um, concrete corners there and the driveway will be power washed. You have a concrete driveway for two vehicles only if there are two drivers. This is um, part of what's the restrictions in the lease. Uh, one person, one vehicle and the maximum amount of vehicles per house is two. So we sadly cannot accommodate three vehicles or four vehicles for that matter. So that's the house on the outside. Now we're gonna hop inside and take a look at this amazing laminate flooring. Like I said, this family has done a lot of upgrades. And here you see the peaked ceiling inside. They've actually moved out quite a bit of items now, so the house is really move in condition. There you see a view of the kitchen and that adorable little uh, window there, that glass window that um, partitions the dining area. Here you see the hutch. You can um, put things from either side of the hutch. On this side, it's glass, and on the other side, it's a wooden door. Here you see the living room area from this angle and the front door. All the mini blinds are staying with the house. Beautiful soothing color. And the laminate flooring continues into the other room, into the kitchen. Here they did an accent wall in the back. They got stainless steel appliances. Again, here's the area for um, dining. The floor is so pretty. It's a really great kitchen, kind of L-shaped there. You've got a dishwasher, your double sink. They actually have a garbage disposal, the stove, and the range top. Again, the lighting above. Lots of cabinet space. They have tile on the backsplash and the laminate countertop. Here's your oven. It's a Whirlpool. Looks like they've never used it. It's great condition. Here's the double sink. And then the hutch from this side. 
like I mentioned before, on the other side is the glass cabinet doors, and on this side is the wood. So you can put any decorative items that you want to show from your living room section side. Here's, again, the eating area. Then there's this little pantry here. You can add extra food items that you would have in your kitchen. It's very handy. Great shelving. Then walking down this side, you've got your thermometer in the hallway. And on the left side, you've got your first bathroom. Again, the laminate flooring, the commode, the countertop, the porcelain sink, the mirror. And then behind the door, you've got your um, fiberglass tub. You've got a fan above, a light above. Let's pull the shower curtain back and take a look. Grab bar there, the handy shower head, and easy step in to the tub. There you see the mirror and the lights above. Little window in the front. And across the hall, you've got your electric panel. I left that open when I first previewed the house. There's all their approvals for all their upgrades. And then in this area, they have a washer and dryer that they're leaving. Again, the laminate flooring. This is a GE. And this is a Whirlpool dryer. Got a rack there, you can hang all your items. There's your lighting. Here's your back door. A look at the neighborhood. And they have shelving there for their extra items. Then continuing, you get to the first bedroom. There's two closets on the right, a bedroom window on the back side. This is probably a full-size bed. You could probably put a king size on that back wall facing the closets. This bedroom is carpeted. And then inside the closet you have the hot water heater panel. So you could put your bed on that wall if you wanted to. The closet's huge. It goes the length of the wall there. Here's the rack, the wire rack. And there's the other side. And again, there's the uh, panel to access the water heater on the far right-hand side. And I have a photograph of that. At the end of this video, you'll see still photographs of the whole house, and um, I highlight that. So for privacy, they usually design um, the house with one bedroom on one end and one bedroom on the other end. And that way you've got privacy. So on this end, you've got your furnace. I believe this also was um, replaced. It's a Maytag. And here's the other bedroom. Big window on that end. And the closet on that wall. And this bathroom is kind of an ensuite. It's part of the bedroom. You don't have to access it from the hallway. Here's the bedroom from this corner. Here's your closet with the wire rack. And then here's your bathroom. 
It's a little bit of an L-shaped bathroom, so to the right is the shower stall, and to the left is the commode. There's a peek in this corner. Laminate flooring again. There's your fan, your light, your bedroom door, and then your shower. There's your porcelain sink. Let's take a peek in here. It's perfect. It's a perfect house for somebody. Two bedroom, two bath in Egg Harbor Township, New Jersey at 22 Quick Street. So if you're interested in this house or any other house in Harbor Crossings, please go to our website, myhomeinharborcrossings.com, fill out the pre-qualifying questions, and then that elicits a series of emails that will be sent to you about the process, about who we are, about purchasing, about the rental criteria, any financing help you might need, and we look forward to seeing who will be the lucky homeowner. And now, enjoy the photographs.
Harbor Crossings is a Dolan Homes community owned by um, the Dolan family. We're a small family business. We've been in operation for almost 40 years now. This is Robert Dolan, who is the managing member of Dolan Homes. We build innovative, quality manufactured homes in our three New Jersey communities. In Edison Mobile Estates, Harbor Crossings, and Carteret Mobile Park. This is my husband, my nephew, and my son. This is our amazing crew. Everyone's on board to build you the most beautiful manufactured home. This is our maintenance team in Harbor Crossings. This is our construction team. Our community is um, a beautiful, safe location for having a home, making it affordable. Harbor Crossings pays the real estate taxes, so you're leasing the land, and we're building beautiful manufactured homes. This is my husband and myself. This is our office fronting Black Horse Turnpike. You can email us for an appointment. We see everybody by appointment only. This is our office. We have everybody go to the website where all the explanations, the process, and the available homes are listed. We're really proud of our location. We're in the downtown Egg Harbor Township area, just about to be redeveloped, which is called the Cardiff Redevelopment and it's going to encompass the whole um, area in which we are located and they'll be adding more sidewalks and better access to stores on the other side where the old Boscovs and the Harbor Square is located and it's a very exciting time to be in Egg Harbor Township. We're minutes from the beaches and great great locations so come check us out we can't wait to hear from you. There's our website. That's where you start.